going on everybody grim repair here today we're going to be changing the motor out on this circulating pump that goes to our lock and bar boiler it's a bell and gossip if this video helps you out be sure to subscribe turn the power off to the unit you're going to need a 1 8 allen key and a half inch wrench look down in these viewing windows and there's the allen key in there you may have to put a screwdriver in there and rotate it to get to it once you loosen that Gonna take the half inch bolts off. There's four bolts holding it to the housing here. You're not gonna want to yank on this too hard. You're gonna break these springs, but you want to pull that off the shaft. And it goes like that. Now you're going to take a Phillips screwdriver, loosen up this cover here, remove the wiring, remove the ground with the one fourth. Take out this conduit, elbow. You got an indentation here on this housing. You wanna line that indentation up with the hex, hex key. Slowly rocking it back and forth on there. I'm going back in through this window here and tightening it down. I'm gonna get the top two started first. Start the bottom two. Once you've gotten all the bolts started by hand, you can go ahead and tighten them all the way up with the wrench. Slide the conduit elbow back in. Fish your wiring through. Put your wire nuts back on. Tighten that back on there. Put the cover back over the wiring. And everything seems to be working now. The flow switch kicked over, the machine's running, water's going through it.